this is something here on Hot Wax we like to do uh, called Frankly Facts. Okay. Let's go. According to a new study in the Journal of Hand Therapy, millennials have weaker muscles in their hands from all the texting, snap, scrolling, and gaming that they do, especially the guys. 100%. 100%. I do my finger Why? push-ups. You got to do your finger push-ups. You got to get your fingers mm. pushing up there in the workout. <laughs> there used to be a sport called ferret legging where a ferret is strapped in a contestant's pants without underwear. The contestant who can stand the teeth and claws long enough wins. Ooh. I'm not playing that. No. No Ooh. way. No way. Frank, I'll let you win. Okay. That's one thing I can let you win. Frank. Yeah. I, I'll, nah. I'll let it go. Neurologists claim that every time you resist acting on your anger, you're actually rewiring your brain to be a calmer and more loving person. Ain't that something? I gotta start telling some people this. <laughs> <laughs> Leonardo da Vinci invented the scissors. Men love the scissor. <laughs> Actress Candace Bergen's father left $10,000 to his ventriloquist dummy and zero to her. Love it. He said the dummy had been his constant companion from who he never separated with, even for a day. Gosh, that's, that's just, that's, that's great. It's great. Wonderful. Just love I it. love that. Love that for Yeah. There is something called non-visible art where works are imagined by the artist and described to the audience. In 2011, a woman named Amy Davidson bought one of these pieces for $10,000, saying she identified with the ideology of the non-visible art project. Did you see the mural I did uh, on the outside of the studio by the back? Yeah. Did you see it? I've, I've been imagining, imagining it, for, it right? for a few years now. I was going to buy that. I think it. it's about $10,000, right? I'm thinking about that. I think I we need to go shop it around, right? Yeah, I should probably. I can't really take pictures, but people could come and yeah, see it. Yeah, yeah. yeah you yeah. can explain it to them very well. <laughs> uh, a study done in 2010 shows that women find men in red to be more attractive. The color makes men appear more powerful and higher in status, which leads to the attraction. 